It looks like Oasis Liam Gallagher and the Stone Roses John Squire might be keeping their collaboration going. The two Mancunian rock legends and current Q magazine cover stars, who recently topped the UK album chart with their self-titled debut, hinted at future plans in a new video posted to social media. Hopefully it'll be one of those records that's got legs and stays around for a while, Squire said in an Instagram reel of their show in London. I think it's got legs, man, Gallagher replied. I think it could be a good thing, and I think it'd be rude not to do another album. The duo just wrapped up the UK slash Ireland leg of their current tour, which sold out within minutes of being announced, and will go on to play more international shows in April. Listen, John's great, I'm great, The Roses were great and Oasis was great, and two of their band members coming together to make a record was always going to excite people, Gallagher told Q Magazine in an exclusive interview earlier this month. I didn't think about Oasis, I didn't think about The Roses. I didn't think about whether it's got to be as good as those bands. There's music coming from both sides, you know what I mean? And this album, it's definitely up there with anything The Roses have done and Oasis have done. I'm sure there'll be a few people that are trying to sabotage it, but that's alright, I don't mind that. I think it's something to fight for. I don't know why this record is so good, Squire added. When I heard the demos back I could have got out at that point and been happy with the project, just to have a shaky demo version of the songs. They were awesome and I couldn't stop listening to them. But, hearing Liam sing, was like getting to the top of a mountain and seeing for miles on the other side. It was a feeling that I'll never forget. I thought the songs were pretty good, but once he'd sung them, it transformed them and I was in awe. I've heard things back and thought, wow, that sounds great or this is rocking, this is trippy, but never like this. Squire also seemed to suggest that the team up wasn't necessarily over. There are a few that might make it to the next record that I've not fully finished, but I wanted to give myself enough time to work on the guitar parts, he explained. They're really uplifting songs and they deserve me to be at my best, Liam said of their collaboration. It's a good match. We were never gonna get F King Scissor players in and a F King trombonist. There was none of that nonsense going on. It was never gonna be funky, it was never gonna be weird SHT. It was always gonna be just the classic kind of thing. And yeah, whatever, it's all been done before and people will say they've have heard it before. Well they're gonna F King hear it again, right?